The project shown in this video can be found in the textbook Technical Drawing 101 with AutoCAD, available from SDC Publications. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do relative coordinates in the line command. So we've covered absolute coordinates and direct entry. A relative coordinate, when it's asking for the second point or the next point of your line, what we're actually going to be specifying is a coordinate based on the or relative to the last point that we were just given. So instead of coming back to your absolute coordinate or your 0, 0, for that new coordinate distance, it's actually going to come from that last line segment or the endpoint of the last line segment. So let's do draw line. Once the first point, so we'll just type in 2 comma 2. And now for the next point, so you saw that it came, that was an absolute coordinate from 0 over 2 up to. For the next point, we're going to type in a new coordinate and this time we're going to type in 2 comma 3. When you have dynamic on, AutoCAD assumes that this next coordinate is going to be a relative coordinate. So if you remember when we were doing absolute coordinates I had to type in the pound sign in order to tell AutoCAD that that was going to be an absolute coordinate and it should have been coming from 2 comma or I'm sorry 0 comma 0. But now I don't have to type a pound sign, I'm just typing in 2 comma 3 and my new distance started here at that last point relative to that last point and it came over 2 and it went up 3. So that's how you do a relative coordinate. You can also do negative entry on relative coordinates. So right now when we're dealing with our Cartesian coordinate system, anytime we're drawing a line that's, that's heading in the um, east direction that's a positive value. If we're heading in the north direction, that's a positive y value. If we head in the west direction, that's a negative x value. And if we head in the south direction, that's a negative y value. So now that I've got this point right here, I just want to show you how we can still use uh, coordinates, we're just going to use negative coordinates to go in a different direction. So I'm going to type in negative 2 comma negative 1. When I press enter, you can see from the last or relative to that last line segment, I'm going over to the west or to the left 2, down or to the south a distance of 1. Press enter and that's how you do the relative coordinates.